people, 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 people. Que pasa, sa, pa, se, what they do. Now, people, this one is called the sleeping policeman. The thief, them take him to toll. May I talk about him service tool and also his personal tool. May I talk about one Glock and also a Barretta. Now, based on the popo, it is said that they are doing an investigation after a popo an unidentified popo went to a location somewhere in Santa Cruz. And when we speak about Santa Cruz, we are speaking about St. Elizabeth. That is said to be the breadbasket capital of Jamaica, a farming community, more than likely. So anyways, people, based on the information, it is said that this popo, he went to a location somewhere, some unidentified location somewhere in Santa Cruz, like I said before. And while he fell asleep, while he went there with a black knapsack with the two told them and uh, four magazines. Um, people, when I speak about magazine, I am not speaking about any Playboy or any H-U-S-T-L-E-R magazine. May I talk about the type that keeps the list for the shows them, for the two shows them. So people, I talk about four of those containing 67 ammunition. So based on the information, he went to this place, an unidentified place. And people, when they talk about an unidentified place, basically they are speaking about a massage parlor. People, I am just speculating. And people, when I speak about massage parlor, I am not speaking about the place that the athletes go. If them have a pull muscle or an arm string pull, rete, lele, blue, blah, bling. I am speaking about the place where basically your nine inch nail can get the whole nine yards. People, you understand what I talk about? I talk about some Portmore back road sort of stuff. Some people like me say, I am just speculating based on the report that is out there in the media. I am just speculating that he basically went to put his bread in somebody's basket. I am speaking about a stranger's bread basket. And when him wake up, him find out say the knapsack gone, him find out say him wallet gone with his identification, cash, credit card, rate, lele, blue, blah, bling. Everything gone off of the chair where him put them. Now, people, when we think about something like this, we can only come to the logical conclusion that he was not home. He was not in his house with his wife and his family. We are talking about picnic, rete, lele, blue, blah, bling. It sounds as if... He was at a place that he probably frequent a lot of time and um, people, if I was to reenact exactly what happened, it would go something like this. So basically the poor poor pull up on the spot and the girl come meet him. Well, go on baby, where you dip on? Boy, you know, see how the special me come for. And people, when we talk about special, me not talk about him 38 special. Me I talk about the discount special. I am speaking about what he always get to basically fix up himself. And people, this is not no mix up, so don't mix up on yourself. So anyways, people, back to the reenactment. So it seems like after him putting bread in our basket, it seems like him fall asleep. So people, we can come to the assumption that this is kind of a logy person. We are talking about a fat man. We are talking about a fat squaddy. So therefore, after him doing thing, after him putting him two minutes of work, it seems like him kind of get tired and him kind of drop asleep. Forgetting that he actually has his tool to them. May I talk about the service tool and his own person. Tool. Forgetting that he is indeed a popo and him basically have to watch him head back, him have to dip on him tippy toe. However, it seems like the work sweet him and it seems like he fell asleep, gone in a la la land. He went to Disney World for a couple of hours. However, after him wake up, him realize that everything gone. The only thing we left at him on the bed and him closed them throw down on the side. So people, based on how it sounds, based on the report, it seems like the same person that he went to for is fix up. She basically mix him up. It seems like she called some people and say, this man there, we are talking about one popo and him fall asleep. We are speaking about fall asleep with him tool and everything in our knapsack. Gone is like him gone in a la la land. So therefore, if you want these two free tools, just come over and pick them up along with his wallet. He is sleeping like a bear. We are talking about peer snoring, rate, lay. 
daily blue blah bling. So people, it seems like that is exactly what happened. Now people, on a serious note, when we think about the fact that this is a popo, when we think about the fact that he has two toes in his possession, how could he actually fall asleep and gone, dazed and confused out of this world and understand, say, him could and lose him life and also lose, we are talking about the government tool and his own personal tool. And people remember, based on what is going on in Jamaica with a lot of persons getting slapped away, a lot of persons getting con, rete, lele, blue, blue, Blah, bling. We are talking about total. We are talking about four magazines and we are also speaking about 67 rounds. So people, we are speaking about the potential for major damage, point blank and period. And people don't get it twisted, don't get it misconstrued. There are some serious professional police out there that are doing their job in a very good way. However, this is a reflection of a lot of police in Jamaica. They are logy, they are very unprofessional, and they are kind of freaky deaky, point blank and period. So anyways, people, based on the information, it is said that the Santa Cruz Criminal Investigative Branch is probing an investigation in the matter. Matter. And people like me say it is a simple case, him kind of logy and them catch him slipping. And people, when them catch you slipping in Jamaica, you are either going to lose your position or your life. And luckily, he did not lose his life. And people, if this was some other person, he would have been gone. We are talking about gone too soon. We are talking about gone till November. We are speaking about November of infinity point blank and period so anyways people that is my views on the whole thing as it pertains to that and like me say it is just my views and opinion it is not the gospel your views and opinion can be respectfully different from mine but let me know what you think in the comment section bless up now before i move to the next part of my video please subscribe to my next channel it is called jamaica dance hall source one word don't put no space between the words and also subscribe to this channel it is called true jamaica buzz and when you subscribe please to press the notification bell and when you press the notification bell please to press all in the option now the next thing that is popping in the news is a very disturbing video that i get on um, people we are speaking about of a domestic type we are talking about a man and a woman and um, people when i say this is very disturbing i cannot even put most of it on youtube because you understand them policy however i will put up an edited version so people take a listen take a look to the part that i can put up and then i'll give my peace let me go you no, stop no, 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 now people, as bad as this situation is, what makes it even worse is the fact that some other men were there, we are speaking about some bystanders, and they were laughing, they were looking at the situation and acting as if it was a joke. And people, the part that when we cut out, may I talk about him gear some Mike Tyson, may I talk about some uppercut, may I talk about at least five or six and him even buck her like a bull. So people may have to ask this question. What possess a woman to be in a relationship with somebody like this? That treat them like that? May I talk about S-H-I-T? May I talk about like filth? 
And people, what is so bad about the situation is that an elderly lady was begging for this woman and he was not even listening. He might tell her, say, if you go talk to God, that means that him not hear nothing, him not no head, him name, not no, him not no sense, him not no sympathy upon the woman. And people, like we say, everybody just turn up and watch it. So anyway, people, if you want this video, please contact me on WhatsApp. Me at talk about 1876 eight nine four twenty seven eleven and people i will be sure to send out this video asap and specifically may i talk about the relevant authority may i talk about the poor poor them need to take this man off of the street because soon or later this lady is going to lose her life and also based on the track record and based on what we see happening in Jamaica upon a daily, monthly and weekly basis, we can only assume that this situation is going to end up in the worst case scenario. If these two people don't part way, and when we talk about part way, we not talk about one end up in the big yard and the next one end up down a dove cut. Because people, if it continues like this, it is inevitable that somebody are going to pass away and somebody are going to get locked up point blank and period so anyways people that is my views on the whole thing as it pertains to that and like me say it is just my views and opinion it is not the gospel your views and opinion can be respectfully different from mine but let me know what you think in the comment section bless up